a electric bill uh, update. We have January, February, March, and April. Of course, April isn't full yet, but uh, as you can see, we're producing more every month because the days are getting longer. And well, I'm running heat pumps now, so that's burning some electricity. But this is the uh, last month bill. If I get things to focus here, I bought 360 kilowatts and sold 3,240. So I ended up with a $207.38 credit. It pays to buy good equipment, maintain it. It's all you all listed. Uh, it's certified. It's all good stuff. It works. It's paying for itself. Where if you buy some of the inferior non-listed equipment, you don't get what you're paying for and it won't produce anything so make sure you look at the label before you purchase it to make sure you get something that's listed so that when you get done installing it it will produce correctly and of course the other thing is you need to take and install it correctly as in like a wind turbine has to be high enough 30 feet above the highest obstruction for 500 feet and that's on the bottom of the blade that's the minimum so if you got to put in a 120 or 140 foot tower that's what you got to do then it will have clear flowing air same thing goes along with solar panels if it's shaded you won't get any power out of it but this is a proof that if things are done correctly that you get the power out of it that you're wanting to get. Like I say, listed and certified. It's, it's, a, it's a, the result of it. And like I say, it makes the investment worth the trouble. 